Something interesting to note if you watch this last video about how an error can be charged without a runner advancing from one base to the next or without the batter advancing to first base if a fielder were to drop a pop-up in foul territory and extend the time of the batter at bat even if that runner is then put out later in the at bat you, the fielder would still be charged with an error and so one thing perhaps a little trivia thing you could stump your friends with is that this is one way that a pitcher perhaps a pitcher would have a perfect game going which meaning that he would have nobody would have gotten on base um, this could take place where we see a, a fielder miss a pop up in foul territory drop it be charged with that error and yet the batter would not have reached base because of that error and therefore if the batter then is later put out um, and the pitcher goes on throws the rest of the game as a perfect game he would have thrown a perfect game even with an error being charged to his team and so that's maybe something you could quiz your friends on how can a, a, a team commit an error and yet the pitcher still keep a his perfect game and this is exactly how this rule right here